Hey guys, in the uh, in the last video, I showed you how to um, uh, create a simple PDF from a, a, a bare bones LaTeX file and run the LaTeX processor. I showed you how to add equations, how to add sections, how to reference the equations, etc. And uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to include uh, a figure, an EPS figure. Now, if you're using LaTeX you're going to have to use a postscript or an encapsulated postscript for your figures and, and in fact encapsulated postscripts are the preferred uh, uh, format. If you're using PDF LaTeX, which I haven't discussed, you can use other uh, uh, file formats such as PDF, PNG, GIF, etc. But we're going to stick with just plain old LaTeX and we're going to stick with EPS files. So let me show you the EPS file which I plan on including in my document so you have an idea what it looks like. Call it myplot.eps. Open it up, and this is what it looks like. Basically, it's just a graph. Um, we have a y label, y-axis label, x-axis label, uh, title, etc. So this is what it looks like. Now, let me show you how to go about adding a figure. Suppose I want to add the figure in my results section. I start by including a begin figure and an end figure. And next, I'm going to say include graphics. And here I'm going to set the width of my graphics, my, my figure, to be uh, one half the text width. Usually that turns out to be a pretty nice size, uh, but you can play around with the text width. You can, you can go three quarters. Uh, uh, one quarter, etc. Whatever you, whatever you like. And the name of my figure is myplot.eps, and I'm probably going to want to include a caption. This is a caption, and I'm also going to give my figure a label, so I can refer to it elsewhere in the document. And it's a good idea to give your, to, to have your figure label coincide with the title or the, the name of your of your EPS file. And that's it. Maybe I'll want to uh, put a space there. Maybe I'm going to want to um, uh, here we go. Let me just put some white spaces in here. So maybe I'm going to want to refer to this figure in the text. So this text refers to fig and again like we did with the equations we're just going to include a reference to that label there we go now I'm going to run LaTeX twice on my tech document once twice I'm going to convert my uh, my DVI file to a PDF. Here we go. And let me open my PDF document. And here it is. So here's my figure. Uh, let's see. These are my these are my results. This text refers to Figure One, etc. This is the discussion. Uh, you'll notice that my my uh, my figure is left justified, and I can correct that. Um, by the following, by centering the figure, So again, run LaTeX twice, convert my DVI to PDF, open my document, and here you go, my figure is centered. So in a nutshell, this is how you'll include a figure in LaTeX. Uh, good luck.